Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. There is a question asked by one of the brothers that uh, how we can strengthen and invigorate our spirituality and what is the importance of piety and morality in the young age? Well, that's a question that is commonly asked, especially by our young brothers and sisters who are more concerned about their faith, iman, piety. And actually, this is a difficult age and they are more prone to the temptations of shaitan. The short answer is that we need to recognize the consequences and outcomes of our moral deficiencies, of our sins, of our bad behaviors that might happen in our old age. This is a common understanding amongst people that they think when people get older, they become more pious or they, their akhlaq will become better. But actually, in some narrations, for example, Imam Ali alayhi salam says that pleasures will die in human being as they age, but the desires will stay with them. Yes, the pleasure, because they will have less energy, their body has aged. So the pleasures will die, but the desire for sin, the desire for that, you know, deficiency will stay with them. And there is a funny story that happened uh, at the time of Abbasid Caliph Harun al-Rashid. One day Harun al-Rashid asked his servant, go and find a person who had witnessed Prophet of Islam and heard a hadith from him. I want to hear, I want to see one of the companions and to listen to a hadith from Prophet of Islam directly from a companion. The servants of Harun said, you know, this is not a time that we can find someone alive from that time of the Prophet. It's more than a century after the demise of the Prophet. Harun insisted and said, go, maybe you'll find it. After a while, they found an old man that could barely move due to his old age. They put him in a basket and brought to Harun's palace. There, Harun asked him, okay, did you hear any hadith from the Prophet? He said, yes, I remember when I was a kid. Uh, I saw Prophet of Islam once in my life. And I heard a hadith from him. What was that hadith? He said, I heard Prophet saying, Human beings ages, but two bad qualities, two bad behaviors will be refreshed and rejuvenated in his soul. Al-hirs wa tulul amal, greed and unattainable aspirations, unattainable wishes. And that is a moral hadith that shows when human being ages, some of their bad qualities will be intensified. Then they say, uh, after hearing this hadith, Harun, Harun the Abbasid Caliph gifted that old man with a purse full of gold coins. When this old man that couldn't even move, couldn't even walk, was carrying him out of the palace, he turned to Harun al-Rashid and said, Oh Harun, you gifted me with these coins. Is it going to be given to me annually and every year? Or this is just for this year? They said, when Harun heard this, burst into laughter and said, Sadaqa Rasulullah. And said, Rasulullah was true when he said, human being ages and two bad qualities will be rejuvenated and refreshed in his soul. Greed and total amal. You are, you know, close to death. You can't even move and you are thinking about the next year and the next years. So, actually, this story and also the hadith of Imam Ali alayhi salam shows us that if we want to become pious and repair our akhlaq, to mend 
our bad behavior, we have to start from young age. Because in the old age, some of the bad qualities will be, you know, rejuvenated and we can't fix them and we can't repair them.